Hello guys and welcome back for another deck review. And today we'll be doing a deck review on the Theory 11 Sentinel stick. Okay, so this is a very nice deck and I highly recommend you go pick it up. Okay, so let's just begin with the box. So as you can see at the top it has Theory XI, which obviously means Theory 11 in Roman numerals. Below it has Sentinels playing cards and then it has the four elements, which is fire, earth, wind and water. Below that has the Ace of Spades, which we'll get into more details about that later on. And it's got this nice circular pattern behind that, and it says Made in USA. And it just has this very nice border going round, and this pattern at the top. It's a very nice detailed front of the box. On one side it has Sentinels in the centre, produced by Theory 11. And it has um, United States Playing Card Company. And then it's, that's just basically reflected, and it's got less swords and nice. It's got this very nice border going around the outside. It's got scroll work on the center as well. On the outside, it has United States Playing Card Company, and it has the same border going around again. Obviously, not with the swords. On the top, it has Sentinels, designed by Hatch SF, and it's got the same sword zigzag border going around, which is very nice. And on the bottom has the standard barcode and a Theory 11 logo. And here is the back design. We'll get into more information about that later on. Okay, so that is the box. And this isn't a normal box, by the way. It's not glossy. It's just like a matte finishes. Actually goes quite well. And it has embossing on the text and the ace and some other details on here. And it's actually quite nice amount. It's not too much, not too little. Okay, so let's just open this up. So on the flap here or tab, it has this nice, this very nice scroll work pattern on here, and you can just get a look at that. It's very nice. And the tabs here, on one of them you've got like this um, ancient Egypt beetle, something like that. It's very nice. And the other one is just black. When you get the cards out, it's just white inside, as you can see. And that's just the box. It's a very nice box, very detailed. Quite like the box. So let's just get on to the back design. Here is the back design. It's very nice. As you can see, it's got this like pyramid or triangle with like this eye in the center. It's got like lines dashing out, and above that, it's got like like two lines in a circle, which is quite nice. And it has below it has like some writing, probably in another language. I'm not going to say it. And then it has like scroll work around the borders, swords underneath. It's very nice. And this is a two-way back design. And it's actually very nice, and this is a double backer you do get with. You also do get a Theory 11 ad card, with there's the Theory 11 logo in the centre, produced by Theory11.com, and some other information. And it's got the backside on the back. You also get two Jokers, which are very nice. In the corners, has Joker. Joker has plastic coated, and it has this jester type character in the centre, like juggling. These three balls with their designs on. It's very nice. You get one blue and one red. Very nice colours. They also have some scroll work beneath. Then the Joker menu, say. Two very nice Jokers. We really like those Jokers. Now let's go on to the Ace. The Ace is very nice. As you can see on the box, it has this sword going directly through it into this nice pattern up here with the scroll work. It's very nice. You've got scroll on the outside as well, which gives it an even better effect. But that has United States Pad Card Company, United States America. And the indexes are also custom in this deck. They are smaller, and the pips are custom as well, as you can see. So, pips are custom, as I just said. And as we move through, everything is custom, as I just said. When you get to the court cards, they are custom again. And yeah, it's just like got the wind symbol there, scroll works, got a bird on his shoulder, and yeah, I won't go into too much details on the court cards, but you can just get a look at them. There's a queen, king, and the ace of diamonds is pretty standard, just diamond in the centre. It's 
very nice indexes. I quite like the small pips, and here's the Jack of Diamonds. Quite like this one with the scar on his eye. Queen of Diamonds. King of Diamonds. King of Clubs. Queen of Clubs. Jack of Clubs. Very nice indexes. Quite like. King's still stabbing his head. And there you go. So, everything is custom in this deck, which I really like. I really like fully custom decks with the indexes custom, core cards, and all the pips. And yeah, let's just get on to how this deck handles. So, this deck spreads very nicely. Let's get these out of the way spreads very nicely cuts very nicely and riffle shuffles very nicely as well it also dribbles nicely and twirls nicely this is a very nice deck the designs are great and yeah but when you spread them in your hands it's kind of hard to see when you do it like so Maybe they're a bit too small, that's just like a little bit up down. But you know, that could be my skill. But um, yeah, this is a great deck, go pick it up. And yeah, this is the Sentinels by Theory 11. Here's just another look at the box. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.